Hey guys, CD Rule 7 here, and uh, I uh, been postponing this uh, video for a day or two because I've had people over and stuff. But uh, now that I've finally gotten round to it, um, two days ago, my FBR came, and I was a bit shocked that it was in this form. It's usually in round circles, but this is actually fine, actually. But um, uh, so I made I started off with this. It's actually pretty nice foam. It, it when you squish it, it doesn't compact and stay squished. It will um, sort of expand out to its original form. And at the start, it looked pretty crumpled, but it's not. It's actually alright. There's only like one or two kinks like that on, and that that's just going to be a bad dart. But that's fine. I can cut that bit out. And um, when it first came as well, there was a bit at the end that was all a bit crumpled, so I had about five or so inches of uh, not very good FPR, but I cut that off and used that to fill dead space in my new Nightfinder, which is all taken apart and doing a lot of cosmetic, which is like the outside looks of it, and internally it's sort of broke, so I'm trying to fix it. but. Um, so I did, I cut a bunch of foam to the length I wanted and then when I made one dart and tested it, it waggled around too much in the air so I had to cut it down to one inch instead of one and a half inch. So I started out by making I think 45 blanks and uh, then I used five of the bad ones to fill dead space in my knife binder again. And <laughs> Then um, I kept the rest and made a few more, so now I've got 66 blanks, which is just foam, no hot glue or anything. And I actually just about like half an hour ago made five more darts, so now I've got 20 Stephens. It doesn't look like match, that's 15. They're all really consistent and they all fly completely straight. And uh, you can see that they all pretty much. Wait, take away these, look. There. They all stand up, which means they've got a good weighting. Um, and that's pretty good. I just used some fishing weights. And they've all got pretty nice domes like that one. They're all pretty nice, actually. And they all fit in my CPVC, if I can get a piece quickly. So this is the barrel that I use. It's one, two, three, three and a bit inches long. Uh, usually I'd use a four. Actually, yeah, I am using four. I'm creating a turret uh, with five barrels. Each one is four inches long. So I've got dark. That one's actually a bit tight, unfortunately. Wait. Poke that one out. There we go. That's a nice one. So that's easy. It goes in there nice. And then I have been using a ram rod just to get it down a little bit and then that shoots fine so uh... ranges are still about seventy eighty but um... yeah that's it really just wanted to say that i've got my fpr and stuff my next video will be on the night finder hopefully when it's done and then i'm going to do how to make my stephens using my foam echo rod uh... tutorial which will hopefully be quite fun. <laughs> um, but that's it. Thanks, and I'll see you soon. Bye.